Welcome to Group Therapy. My name is Mr. Bonwater, and I will be your therapist for today. So what we're going to do is talk about our feelings. We're going to go around in the circle and talk about what each of our, our struggles and our conditions are. We're going we're gonna to relate to each other. We're going to work out unresolved issues. And we're going to talk about it all. And I'm going to be here with you through it all. And as you'll notice in the room, we have various instruments. This is so that patients can express themselves. Because we like to do things a little bit differently around here. At, over at Holistic Vitamin Practices. We got to, like, express what we're feeling. So, it's just like that, just like, just so whatever it is you're feeling. Last night I watched another episode of that same old show that I watch every night. And it was really sweet with the Turkish delight. Thank you all for having me today. And you know, I have a serious problem, and it's <laughs> with everybody here. <laughs> ah, come on, get out of here. My name is Flenderson Corny. Hi, Flenderson Corny. Yeah, I listened to music on the bus on the way over here for a while, and that was cool. I hear he was just really nervous about telling you, you guys. About my problem. It's okay, man. I'm, I'm addicted to talking to other addicts about my addiction to talking to other addicts. It's just so hard. <laughs> <laughs> so I got this thing with spoons. <laughs> yeah, yeah, have a laugh. Heard it all before. I just can't get enough of it. I keep one in my pocket for good luck. I like spoons. I need something. It reminds me of the food that I ate. It was like uh, the broccoli and, and uh, the fucking the pot pies with the chicken in them and the, the chicken and the potatoes and the cheese and the broccoli. And uh, so I got this thing with spoons. So what? Everybody, everybody got there something, something. I got a thing for spoons. I got it. I like to do things with spoons. I keep them on my shelf. People say, what do you do with spoons? Why do you collect these? Sp I put them on my shelf and I look at them. And I say, damn, that's a pretty spoon. Boy, what you in for? I stole it. Some drumsticks. Some drumsticks, mate? They got you cooped up in here for a couple of drumsticks. That's some straight bullshit it is. You know, this ain't my first time here, you know? Yeah. You ever been in the loony bin before? No, this is my third time. Oh, then you know what's like. Mm. You lock you up like a dog. A fucking dog, mate. <laughs> I didn't want to come here today. But I'm addicted to orange like as the color one time when my mom was sleeping I painted her toenails orange I didn't like but when, I didn't know that she was a pedicurist at a salon and it fucked her job up okay okay so fucking like no disrespect mate but like you're saying you're addicted to, like, the, the fucking, like, the color orange? That's right? Yeah. You don't got a bloody thing on this orange. How are you gonna be fucking addicted to orange with that, with no fucking orange on? I'm fucking eccentric. That's what I do, you know? Sometimes I fucking wear my hat the other direction. And that's fucking okay, you know? Because I'm fucking eccentric. Because that's what I'm fucking about, you know? I got a fucking style. I got a fucking way of expressing myself. What are you fucking doing with this plaid shirt fucking... 
fucking half button shit. You ain't got, you've got any fucking orange on, mate. I'm fucking out of here. That's fucking it. I'm gonna be go to be eccentric somewhere else. So what's your deal? Like you were in like South Africa, right? I never thought I'd be addicted to orange. I had orange floors when I was growing up. And those were cool. I could do the moonwalk on those. I never seen Michael Jackson dress in orange either. He probably has like to have a wardrobe like his, there's like plenty of orange. So are you gay or and I I don't think it's no crime, man. But I'm addicted. <laughs> I think we've made a lot of progress today, group. Thank you for coming and being a part of holistic vitamins practices. Uh, we hope that you'll come again and be well on your way to rehab and have foy houses and all of that. Stick around for more.